Matchbox is mainly designed for everyone downstream of Picture Editorial. But there are definitely some useful workflows for the Assistant Editor or VFX Editor. To properly understand Matchbox, you should check out all of the various tutorial videos, but we'll quickly walk through a basic workflow now. While Matchbox can import an AAF of your timeline, it doesn't try to link each clip, interpret the effects, and display the actual frames. Matchbox simply uses your AAF or EDLs as metadata to help find picture and sound changes. So you will normally start by importing a reference movie file for each of the old and new versions. Then drag in the AAF or EDLs if you have them. Now simply run one of the matchup functions. If you've only got reference movies, then use matchup video files. If you have the AAFs or EDLs, then use matchup video clips. The result is a set of matches, these green objects, which represent sections of footage within which nothing has changed. We'll also take a look at the purple diffs layer. These are subsections where we managed to find a shot match, but Matchbox noticed that there's something different. Even if there's been no cut change, we definitely want to know when the picture editor has made a change like this. As a means of simply visualizing the changes, Matchbox is very handy, but you can also use it to help manage your VFX workflow. Using the list views, you can filter down and export lists of various parts of the sequence. For example, in the old sequence, you can search for just the VFX shots, and just the ones which seem to be dropped from the cut. Or you can find all the VFX shots for a particular scene, or from a particular vendor. If some new shots have been added, we can simply select them, filter the list by selected only, and then export these shots to a list. You can also use the markers list to find problematic or expensive changes, such as extensions to VFX shots. Matchbox also gives you a powerful tool for visualizing every tiny change in a new VFX handover. The visible diffs will lead you to any change so you can be confident that you've eyeballed and approved every new element. For each shot, you can drop markers inside Matchbox and these can be exported to Media Composer. Likewise, the automatically generated change markers can be exported, and these are categorized by type, allowing you to deal with insertions and deletions differently. Diffs can also be exported as markers, giving you a nice reference inside Media Composer when working with the new cut. And we're interested in adding more features for picture editorial workflows. If you see some unfulfilled potential for your workflow, then please do get in touch.